hi in this short demo uh, we will see how to use the inline data declaration concept in SAP ABAP and also we will see how to display the data very quickly using the class CL underscore SLV underscore table so inline data declaration we can use from the release 7.4 onwards so we will see what is the inline data declaration so typical way of uh, declaring a data is like uh, first we have to declare a data this is the internal table of type EKKO and then only we can select data from database into the internal table but it should be already declared in the declaration part okay so here I have declared GT underscore EKKO table and also the EKPO table okay check activate execute execute so I can see in the EKPO table there are 20 records and also in the EKPO okay but what if I remove this I am commenting this now if I if we check this system will give the error GT underscore EKKO is unknown because it is not declared so here we can use the inline data regression concept it is very simple select single all from EKKO into table what we have to do just add on iterate data and in the bracket give the table name gt underscore ekko up to 20 rows now check now you can see the system is giving the error for the ekpo table okay line number 15 means system has not given any uh, error at this level this means data is success, uh, this data is declared successfully now we will do for the EKPO table in the same way. Now, if GT underscore EKKO what is not initial, what we do do? Select all from EKPO at the rate data bracket and host variable generally used for all entries. The host variable we just need uh, to add at the rate. Here we don't have to write the data data is only one time at the time of declaration okay now in the same for all entries give a iterate save check activate the system has not given any error execute execute you can see the data 20 records are there you can see all the, uh, the data structure same as the EKPO table okay go to also uh, EKPO you can see 20 records are there in, also in the EKPO table okay so in this way we can use the inline data regulation now here what I have done I have selected all the records right suppose if you want to select a specific field then in that case what we have to do select ABLN here in normal ABAP how we uh, do we do a date BSART but when you are using the inline declaration we have to separate using comma then only it works otherwise it will not work okay first check without giving the comma into table gt underscore ekpo command this 7 check you can see the host variable is escape using at the rate the new SQL must be used okay what is the new scale the field must be separated using the comma separator now save check oh okay from ekko into table check okay so whenever you want to select a specific field we have to separate the fields using comma else we can use the first method for all entries now we have selected the data into ekko and ekpo so we will see how to display data using sale underscore sl underscore table 
for that now the normal method declare a table type reference to cl underscore slv table go to pattern all the factory method go to above objects in the class and the method is factory call the factory method of this class here table and which table we want to display gt underscore ekko now call method gr underscore table display save check and activate execute execute so we can see the output very quickly okay so in this way we have seen how to use the inline data declaration in sap ABAP. also we have seen how to display data very quickly using the factory method of cl underscore slv underscore table thank you